Is that it? Hey, I'm talking to you. What? It? It's what? What do you mean, what? The place you're fucking taking us. He doesn't speak much English. Arvo, is this where the supplies are? Where the food is? Answer her, goddammit! No, it's at the house. It's still more walk. Some more hours. God damn it! I knew this was gonna happen. This guy fucked us. Uh, thank you. I'll mention it. It's getting dark. Maybe we should stop for the night. This is bullshit. Relax. Don't tell me to relax. He's lying. He's been lying this whole time. Luke needs a break. We probably all do. Look, I'll do whatever you guys want, okay? But I could use the rest. It'd be safer to rest in there, where there's a fence. Can we just try and have a calm, quiet night? Please. That sounds nice. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it does. Oh, shit. Sorry about that. It's all right, buddy. It's all right. If we're staying, we should scout this place out. All right. Y'all wait here. I'll go make sure this ain't some walker nest we're locking ourselves into. I'll go with you. Uh, see if, uh, see if you can calm him down a bit. No, that's all you. Guess that'll work. Me neither. I think he likes you. Calmed right down for you. He's cute. Yeah, he is, isn't he? Most babies are pretty ugly this soon after being born. That's true. They usually look like weird little aliens. Here, I got him. Come on over. It's safe. <clears throat> Today's my birthday. Here as I can tell, at least. Well, happy birthday, Luke. Yeah, man. Happy birthday. So, how old are you now? I am 27 years old. That's pretty old. Sure as hell feel a lot older. Don't even start with that shit. Got out of college five years ago. Feels like a million years. At least I don't have to worry about paying off them student loans. I hear that. I'm sure there's some asshole sitting on that paperwork, waiting to collect. What did you study? Majored in art history. That's cool. <laughs> Sounds like you majored in working in a coffee shop. Pretty much. Oh, stop it. You get a minor in agriculture. Keep the old man happy. Oh, I almost forgot. I was saving it for a special occasion, and... All it being your birthday and all, figure, this is as good a time as any. I feel a little guilty taking the first Whoa, uh... wait! You gotta make a toast. I'm not really the, uh... Come on, birthday boy. It don't have to be fancy. A toast means we all got something to drink. Oh, we can just pass the bottle around afterwards. Go on. <clears throat> to the loved ones. And to the hope that we see them again. Someday. Here, here. That was real nice. Yeah? I didn't mean for it to rhyme. That was... Well, I got first watch. I think the fence has got us pretty secure. Can't be... I can take it. Nah, you stay warm. Clem, let him go. I'm gonna post up over near the hole in the fence there. Holler if you need anything. Thanks, Kenny.
Fire's real nice. Plenty of room if you want to get warm. Maybe in a bit. I didn't expect her to come back. Just when I thought I got her figured out, she up and surprises. It's a good thing. You saved our ass. I know. I know. I just... don't know what she's getting at all this. We're lucky to have her. I'm glad she's here. Well, she helped us back there. So that puts her as okay in my book. Well, it ain't no secret how you feel about her. Oh, come on. I'm just teasing. Ed was stupid. I understand. She's a pretty girl. Once you get past all the dirt and guts. I don't know. Guess I just wanted to forget about all this shit for like ten minutes. Ten minutes? Man, that's longer than I'd last at this point. Hey! Alright, alright, it wasn't ten minutes. Come on. We got a little one around. Sorry. Forget I said anything. I know what you guys are talking about. I certainly hope not. You're talking about kissing stuff. Uh, yeah. Yes, yes, that, that is exactly it. Was there any kissing? You shut your mouth right now, the both of you. Maybe she came back for you. Could be. I don't know what to say to that. <laughs> well, I guess we learned something. Yeah? Well, what's that? Luke's a regular Casanova. Hey, shut up. Don't be modest. Your moves are working on all the ladies. Worked on me. Oh, shit. I just did it too, didn't I? Sorry. It's the drink talking. They say a drunk man's talk is a sober man's thoughts. Well, I ain't a man, so they can take that shit somewhere else. Clem, go see if you can get Jane and Kenny over by the fire. It's too cold for them to be out there like that. Oh, and here, maybe a swig of this will change their minds. They expect you to lure me over there with alcohol? I wouldn't have expected a bottle to last this long. Will it work? That depends. What is it? It's rum? Probably. I don't know. It, it might be awkward. I wasn't expecting to... You know... Be around. Why? Because you made it with Luke? What does that even mean? What's the it? You know... Yeah. Because I made it with Luke. It's not a big deal. Why does this feel like I'm signing... Really good. Have you had any? You wanna sip? It's okay. Um, sure. <laughs> you okay? Uh-oh, busted. I better take that back. I wasn't too much older than you when I had my first drink. God, I was so stupid back then. There was this time I broke into my parents' liquor cabinet and drank a whole bottle of this really spicy, sweet liquor. Oh. What was its name? Earthquake or something. Sounds like you were a bad kid. I guess I was. At the bottom of the bottle, there were these sugar crystals. And I got it in my head that I really wanted to eat a couple. So I got the bright idea to smash it on my parents' dining room floor to get at them. Shattered into a thousand pieces all over the dining room. And I proceeded to eat what I thought was sugar candy. It was not sugar candy. 
The problem with glass is, it looks a lot like sugar crystals. That's never really been a problem for me. Keep it that way. My sister found me, drunk, blood pouring out of my mouth. Jamie thought I was dying, so she called 911. They pumped my stomach. I grounded for six months. You ate glass? I ate glass. I haven't thought about that in a long time. I guess a deal's a deal. Here. That guy needs a drink more than any of us. Weird. Wanna sit here? No. That's... I'm fine. Oh, yeah. Wherever you like. I'm... I'm sorry about your sister. Leave me alone, please. I miss TV. Feels like forever since we had electricity. There, there, little guy. Shh. Shh, I got you. I got you. Hey. Oh, hey, Clem. I'm starting to think she might be a bad influence on you. Girl your age? It ain't right. Of all the things I've done, that I've seen, I really don't think it's a big deal. Yeah, I I'm sorry. You're right. It's probably not my place to be telling you what to do. It's a nice night. Just, uh, needed some air. Kenny, there's air everywhere. I'm sorry for, for how I acted back there. After Sarita was... I just... I, I couldn't handle it. I'm sorry. I mean, you did what you could. You tried to help, and I blamed you for it. I'm so, so sorry. You don't have anything to apologize for. I know you didn't mean it. Thanks. I miss my boy. I miss him so much. I didn't raise him like I should have. Made mistakes. Wasn't there a whole lot for a couple years. Off on a boat somewhere or other. I thought I enjoyed that time away from him. From my family. I'd give anything for one more second with them. Play catch with Doug. Touch Katja's face. Maybe you'll see them again someday. Well, from here on out, I'm gonna try and believe that too. It's gonna be different with him. He's gonna get raised right. I won't make the same mistakes again. That's a promise. You should get back over by the fire. Ain't no sense in both of us being over here. I can handle watch on my own. 
The baby might be cold. Maybe you should bring him by the fire. Yeah, okay. Seems secure enough. For one night, anyways. <laughs> Jane, you don't have to justify that with a response. Hey, I find it's best to just get this stuff out in the open. Less drama. Well, that's fine. But I can confirm there was no time for kissing. All right, enough of that. Hey, you Clem. It's nice to hear people laughing. Yeah, it is. You just... Spend so much time trying to stay alive that you don't get a chance to enjoy living. Yeah. We need to make more time for that. Alcohol helps. <laughs> Hell yeah, it does. Let me get that bottle. We got someone else that might need some help. Sounds like a waste of good rum. He lost his sister today. Whose fault was that? That makes it even harder to deal with. Trust me. Kenny, please, don't let it ruin a nice night. I said my piece. I don't think that boy's a bad person. I just think good people do bad things sometimes. And they do it a lot more nowadays with the world being what it is. So, I think it's best Leave to... Leave me alone! My fault. I shouldn't have... Leave me alone! Please, dude. It's okay. It's okay. She's in a better place. It's okay. It's okay. Maybe it's best if we all get some rest. Who knows how long a walk we got tomorrow. Yeah, that's a good idea. I'll take first watch. Thank you, Kenny. Really. I, uh... Don't mention it. You did good. It was nice while it lasted. <laughs> 